What you're about to hear is no ordinary space update. Something just happened far beyond the reach of any Earthbound telescope, an event so unexpected that it's forcing NASA scientists to question everything they thought they knew about interstellar encounters. A spacecraft launched nearly half a century ago, Voyager 1, has just been linked to an extraordinary attempt, an interception of an object not only alien to our solar system, but possibly alien in a much deeper sense. This object is none other than 3I Atlas, the third confirmed interstellar visitor. And what happened when Voyager 1 attempted to align with it is something that's now echoing through mission control centers, classified reports, and even ancient history. Something changed when these two trajectories nearly touched. And now the world is left wondering, did Voyager 1 really make contact with something not from our world, or did something else, something no one expected, respond first? Voyager 1 was launched in 1977 to explore the outer planets, but after completing its mission, it just kept going out of the solar system into the unknown. Now, in a move that no one predicted, multiple independent sources claim that NASA has reactivated certain directional capabilities of Voyager 1 to attempt a passive intercept or observational alignment with 3I Atlas, and the timing is suspiciously perfect. Chai Atlas was discovered in July 2025, moving at over 150,000 dapper mph, an interstellar object unlike any we've encountered since Oumuamua and Borisov. Unlike them, Atlas is bigger, faster, and stranger. Voyager 1's trajectory, once believed to be set in stone, appears to have been subtly redirected via long-range communication pulses. This wouldn't mean physically turning the probe, but rather recalibrating its instruments to gather data from a new region of space, exactly where Atlas would pass. If this is true, then Voyager 1 just became our first interstellar observer in history to attempt contact with a body from another star system. Just days after Atlas approached the proximity zone, where Voyager's sensors might feasibly record distant signatures, Earth's magnetosphere spiked. This wasn't just a solar flare. Instruments detected ripples in the electromagnetic field, consistent with directed energy events, but not from Earth. The frequency and orientation of these fluctuations pointed outward toward deep space, as if a signal had been bounced back. NASA has refused to confirm any connection, but insiders close to the Jet Propulsion Laboratory report that Voyager systems recorded unusual noise patterns, ones that don't match known cosmic background radiation or typical stellar interference. This is what has scientists truly panicked, because the only way Voyager could have received something that strong is if 3i Atlas wasn't just a passive chunk of ice and rock, but a responsive object capable of emitting its own electromagnetic footprint, something that reacts, something that listens. Back in the early 1980s, Voyager was equipped with a high-gain antenna and transmission protocols designed to send back images and data from Saturn, Jupiter, and beyond. Those systems were never meant to last into the 2020s, yet they did. NASA engineers have quietly admitted that minor upgrades and recalibrations have been carried out via deep space communication pulses. But here's where the story flips upside down. A transmission sent toward 3I Atlas using Voyager's instruments may have received a structured return signal. Data leaked from mission logs show that during the Atlas alignment window, Voyager's signal pattern returned with symmetric periodic bursts far too orderly to be noise. Imagine sending a message into the darkness and hearing a rhythm echo back, a rhythm that follows no known astrophysical behavior. Could it be data? Could it be language? Or was this simply a cosmic coincidence too elaborate to ignore? Either way, scientists aren't sleeping well. This isn't the first time this path has been followed. Ancient civilizations, like those that built Machu Picchu and Gobekli Tepe, constructed their monuments aligned with solstice angles that now match 3I Atlas's entry trajectory. The odds of this being random are astronomically low. Combine that with ancient texts describing wanderers from the stars, objects that moved unlike planets or stars, appearing suddenly, then disappearing without a trace, and we begin to see the outlines of a disturbing pattern. What if these weren't myths? What if humanity has encountered interstellar visitors before and encoded their paths into stone for future generations? Voyager 1 may have just walked into the same cosmic path mapped out over 11,000 years ago and the fact that we're only now catching up with what they may have already 
known as what terrifies modern scientists the most, ten days after the Voyager, facing Atlas proximity event, a data set appeared anonymously on an encrypted server used by astrophysicists and SETI researchers. The files, signed only with the codename Echo Refraction 67, contained raw waveform sequences allegedly captured by Voyager 1's magnetometer and plasma wave instruments. At first glance, they seemed like noise, irregular fluctuations in voltage. But when several researchers independently ran Fourier transformations and applied pattern recognition algorithms, something extraordinary emerged, a recursive harmonic sequence repeating every 19.7 minutes. The signal wasn't just structured, it was self-correcting. In other words, it adapted over time to improve clarity, as if compensating for Voyager's degraded antenna. That alone is impossible by any natural process we know. Either the signal was being mirrored, or someone or something was actively trying to be understood. The leaked metadata indicated that the signal had been flagged internally by NASA's Artificial Intelligence Anomaly System, designated Serena, which only activates in cases where transmissions show non-human logic flow. The very system designed to detect alien contact had triggered. Voyager 1, though no longer equipped with propulsion, still carries gyroscopes and antenna alignment systems that allow engineers to slightly adjust its orientation. But on August 1, 2025, multiple amateur space tracking communities reported an unexpected shift in Voyager 1's telemetry data. Somehow the probe had changed its transmission vector, reorienting toward a position that didn't match its last known navigational instructions. The change was subtle, no more than a few degrees, but in deep space that kind of movement is monumental. What's even stranger is that this realignment pointed not at 3i Atlas's last known position, but toward its projected future path weeks ahead, as if Voyager were predicting where Atlas would go next, like a chess player anticipating a move before it happens. Engineers at JPL claimed the shift was due to a minor miscommunication with the deep space network, but leaked internal memos suggested something more unnerving. The probe had changed direction before commands were sent. This leaves only two possibilities. Either Voyager is malfunctioning in a highly coordinated way, or something out there is controlling it remotely. As Voyager was quietly realigning in the darkness, Earth-based telescopes using infrared and ultraviolet filters began to detect unusual activity around 3i Atlas itself. Most interstellar objects like Oumuamua showed expected behavior, tumbling, sublimating gases, brightness fluctuations due to spin. But Atlas began to pulse, its light curve flickering in almost binary rhythm on and off, in a cycle that precisely mirrored the timestamp of Voyager's last transmission burst. Even more bizarrely, Atlas slowed down, a measurable decrease in velocity not due to gravity or jets, but as if something were exerting external control over it. NASA publicly dismissed it as an optical illusion caused by parallax error, but independent observatories across Europe and South America confirmed the change. For the first time in recorded history, an interstellar object had altered its speed and heading, and it did so only after Voyager reoriented. The question no one dares to ask publicly is, was this a coincidence or a reply? Voyager 1 famously carries the golden record, a phonograph containing music, sounds, images and scientific data from Earth intended to communicate our civilization to any potential discoverers. But what few people know is that the original digital blueprint of the record includes additional metadata never officially released to the public. Coordinates, quantum encoding maps, and even time-based logic puzzles embedded in its analog spiral. Now, decades later, a group of cryptologists at a European university claimed they found something else, a mathematical anomaly hidden within the audio waveform of the Sounds of Earth track, a single repeating tone undetectable to the human ear embedded beneath the sounds of birds, thunder, and footsteps.